Hello everyone, Matt here. Thanks for joining me today and I'm bringing back Tech Tuesdays or Technical Tuesdays. I used to do these a while back and I figured why not get back into it. So I want to start with uh, Bitcoin and I want to show a trade that we have we did recently. Uh, so right here on the 22nd of March and today is the 26th. Uh, you can see here I said I want to be long at 63 half my stops at 61 and the first target is at 67 half I have a little invalidation here if price does this then I don't want to be in the trade anymore and that's kind of how it went so you can see uh, this chart over here uh, you can see it was right on this green level and as I come here and I zoom in a little bit uh, this is where it was at it was coming down here it hit my target I got in uh, never got stopped out and then price went in my favor and I started taking profits up here and up here and then I have a little bit left on and my stop is right here so that is uh, a trade that we did recently uh, we're still in it I wanted to highlight that and every week I'm going to try to highlight a trade and I'll probably get my face in these uh, eventually as well as I as I get back on YouTube but anyway Bitcoin is uh, looking good it bounced off this section and what am I looking for overall that's a good question I'm glad you asked so if I zoom in here uh, this is kind of what I'm watching for you know I was watching for you know price to get up in here and and you know make a, a top basically a temporary top uh, that happened and it sold off now it's moving back higher and now is really the question of what is going to really happen if it breaks down here then it could get a little bit uglier there's a couple different paths that can actually take hold so I want to highlight that uh, there is a possibility that it can just chop higher I think the higher probability is that either it buys up here and get some resistance and then it starts to sell off or this can come a little lower get some support move up again and then start to sell off uh, there is a possibility like I said to keep moving higher in a choppy fashion and it really needs to hold over this lower excuse me this low right here if it were to do that then there is a possibility even though it's less probable than everything else and it's very ugly uh, but that's what would play out so I'm I'm looking at either this moving up one more time into this zone here which the zone would be anywhere from 71 75 to ideally it would be below 72 to 89 but if it were to get into the 73s that's not you know terrible so I think it moves up again here, uh, holds over that uh, this blue line down here at 68381, uh, moves up and then gets some resistance. And I'm looking for price to come lower. Uh, there's a few things that could play out. And one of them is staying over the screen zone. That's possible. And price would just chop sideways for a little while inside of this range. So it would stay over 62, it would stay under wherever the top is up here, whether it's right here, or it moves up a little bit more. Wherever that is, it would stay under that, it would stay over 62 and just chop sideways, and then eventually, you know, find support and start moving up again. That's possible. Uh, that would be a weird, ugly little triangle thing. Uh, if it were to come lower, then I'm looking down here somewhere between 51154 and 57289. So that's kind of what I'm looking in that little zone. So, you know, I'm going to be watching this. You know, I, I, my trade was from here to here. And like I said, I still have a little bit of my stops down here. I'm just watching it to see what's going to happen. It's going to be interesting. But I think a lot of things are kind of set up like this right now. Uh, where it's just very ugly, just waiting for something to play out. Uh, that is Bitcoin. And then I'm going to do Cardano. Because Cardano's like, my home is Cardano. My project Alpha Surfers is Cardano. Uh, if you are interested, 
I do trades like this all the time. Uh, we do trade alerts, and uh, just like the one I showed you earlier, and uh, we do them in Discord. So the Discord for Alpha Surfers is linked in the description. Uh, let me go to Cardano. Cause I know Cardano is interesting, and, and a lot of people are talking about Cardano. Uh, I was looking at this box right here. Uh, let me zoom in here. Uh, you can see price moved up here into this resistance box, and it had a nice rejection off of that. And what I'm looking for is another move down here to this blue line and then the possibility of it moving up again. Um, let me zoom out here. All right. And this is kind of what I'm looking for. So it comes down again to this blue line. It doesn't have to get all the way to it. So anywhere between 64 or 63, uh, I guess 62 and a half would be okay. It doesn't quite have to get to 61.89. And then it can move up a little bit more, and that 70 to uh, 72 cent range would be resistance. And then we should see it come back down into that 50 cent, maybe upper 40 cent area. Uh, my targets are, it's a wide range, so 46.98 to 56.67 is what I'm watching for Cardano. I think it's interesting right here. Uh, just because it is very choppy and you know cardano routinely does move in a choppy fashion right like if you look at this move up here that's very choppy it's very ugly very choppy it just is what it is uh, this whole move very choppy and ugly uh, this move here was a little bit more uh, weak to the downside uh, so very interesting but this is kind of what i'm looking at it did hit this level it is selling off a little bit which is what I expected and now I'm looking for it to move up again and then start to move down. Um, I would say less probable, but it could play out like Bitcoin where if it, once it comes up here, it can just move sideways, but I don't think that's very likely. I think it's more likely to break this low here or at least get very, very close to it. So that's uh, really my prognostication for Cardano come down, come up. I think that's very interesting. Um, if you guys have any crypto you would like me to cover, throw them in the comment section down below or join the Discord and let me know and I can uh, I can uh, look into that. So anyway, with that, hopefully you did enjoy the video. Have a great, great rest of your day. I'll see you around the markets. Take care.